Hey guys, welcome back to the Parkiverse. This week, I thought I'd bring you guys a super quick guide on one of the most underrated minimalist launches, which is available on the Play Store. Perfect for those of you looking for alternatives to Niagara Launcher, and is color customizable to match your awesome wallpapers. But before we get started, if you like this video and want to see more just like this, make sure you like and subscribe to help support the channel. And don't forget to submit your live wallpaper and home screen requests right from within the Epic Live Wallpaper app. Just head to the live section and then click on the request button. And remember to boost your favorite ones using both the heart and the booster buttons here. So here it is, a launcher focused on minimalism and bringing a much needed level of organization to our stock Android phones. The Tuckan Launcher. This home screen launcher swaps out our traditional home screen icons and app drawer with a simple clean keyboard. With all our apps organized alphabetically, breaking down our long list of apps into bite sized chunks. But don't worry, for our most used apps, we can add them to the star button, which is actually our favorites list. And if you wanted to access all of your apps at once, just simply press the asterisk button. Now this Android launcher actually has two hidden screens, which you can access by simply swiping up. The first of which not only allows you to quickly search for any of your apps, but also do some quick calculations. So if you're ever in need for a quick access calculator, this one's designed for you. Now swiping up for a second time, you'll get this Google login prompt. And once you've logged in, you get access to these little hidden gems. A full screen flashlight, a one touch click counter, QR code reader, and my favorite of the four, the game 2048. All of which built directly into the launcher itself. Now as for the settings, you can access this via the explanation mark button on the keyboard. It is pretty bare bones at the moment, however, it still comes with a few customization options, including changing the launcher's font as well as its accent color, allowing you to come up with some truly unique looks. Hopefully, the developer continues to add more features, but as it's a free launcher, why not give it a try yourselves and let me know what you think of it down in the comments section below. If you like this video and want to see more just like this, make sure you like and subscribe to help support the channel. And make sure you check out my other Android customization videos. See you next time on Into the Parkiverse.